This morning, weeks after the tragedy at the Life Care Center in Washington State first brought the coronavirus crisis into focus, the virus is taking a growing toll on senior care facilities across the country. A number of the staff were very worried. They were scared. In Richmond, Virginia, at least 35 people have died at this facility. <laughs> and this week, similar scenes in Elizabeth, New Jersey. We don't know, you know, exactly what. We just want to take a look. In Athens, Georgia. The CDC reporting virus outbreaks in more than 400 long-term facilities. And now, a growing protest. I know the community is seeing us like as, you know, I don't know if they're, they're looking at us like we're banning impatience. Staff at this nursing home in Southern California now refusing to show up at work, saying the danger of becoming infected is too great. I don't want people thinking we're bad. It's just we're not being properly protected. All 84 residents of the home have been forced to evacuate. They're now being relocated to different health care facilities across the county. Staffers say the fear is legitimate, with dozens of residents already testing positive. But the Board of Health accuses the workers of jumping ship when they're needed the most. He described what they did as abandoning their patients. Um, and, 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 and that's uh, how strongly he felt about it. Yes, so with this uptick, some states are making some urgent moves. In Los Angeles County, instead of isolating the elderly in these facilities, officials are creating an exception to the stay-at-home order, calling on families to bring their elderly relatives home, if at all possible. Kenneth, Mona? Kimberly, thank you. Hi everyone, George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.